me and Ziggy are here with more Lego sorting. Um, if you're new around here, I am an eBay reseller. Um, my name is Linda and I have a bunch of stuffed frogs. Um, so I sell stuff on eBay. Mainly I do clothes because, you know, it's, it's, it's easy to do clothes. But one of the other things that I do sell is Lego. And I buy job lots of Lego and then I sort them through and I try and stick to vintage Lego, which I'm surrounded in because I've already done, I've already done the majority of the sort because I thought the, I thought the initial intro that I did to this video was a bit long winded. So this is two job lots that I've got here, both of which I spent including the postage about 30 pounds on one of them is just sundry lego and there's not much to it it's just bits that i wanted to add to other stuff the other one really good job lot also i thought <laughs> um i ordered this at the beginning of september and then took four weeks to arrive in the post because it was sent by every or yodel or something i think it was yodel i don't know but it was just completely lost in the post um well it wasn't lost they just had, weren't bothering to deliver it and it's a real shame because the stuff which has come through it's got a complete crossover with one of the previous um job lots which i sorted and it's got loads of instructions it had a bundle of instructions that came with of it and a bunch of the instructions are for stuff which I've already done. So that, I mean, I sold that set straight away without instructions and without stickers. And it's actually got some of the pieces here, which were missing. So frustrating. And um, that one as well, it had, it's got the instructions for, I don't think I've got all the pieces, but I'm going to look. Um, I couldn't believe it. So there's so many sets which I've now already sold, which I could have had the, the set, the um, instructions included for. Um, I've also got like two books, various brochures. That's something which I've previously sold, but literally like six, to eight months ago, I sold that. So I'm going to sort through this and see what I can get listed. I'm going to try and do it as quickly as possible. So that's another one. Um, that one I had ages ago so yeah one of this one of the job lots is definitely worth it another one um, I didn't get my notification on eBay in time for me to like properly think about it and it, when I picked up my phone it said um, literally 20 seconds left so I just bid high um, so it probably you know it's cost me that but I have got stuff which I can add to other things. As in, it's got that base plate which I need for that. So, here's all the sort of the Lego. And then I'll show you what sets that I've actually managed to pull out of this. So that I can get them built and photographed and listed as soon as possible. And get some money back on this. Um, yeah, I'll make, I'll make money on this just... I'm getting used to like having some real killing <laughs> on my Lego listings and this probably isn't like a huge profit but there's still profit in it. Right, very poor amount of Lego. Anyway, it's clean. The sun's done its thing. I think it's more or less dry. So I am going to sort it, add it to the pile that I've got there and then hopefully I can pull together some of these sets that I've got in here. Of course, it's in the Necronomicon. Yeah, you're not allowed to speak. You're not allowed to speak about this author anymore, are you? Because he's of an era. Anyway, I'm going to sort through all this and see what I've got. I'm not very hopeful. Um, yeah, this, I, I think this was a poor spend. Because obviously it's two job lots and there's hardly any there. I should have owned, this should be like £30 for a lot of it. But because it's like two lots of £30, this is a stupid buy. If I could guarantee that it was all of these, this would be fantastic. But I know it's not. I know that there's, I don't think there's any complete sets here. Only, only the smaller ones. 
but even some of them I'm very very dubious um it's just that's a sound button which I've got to test uh yeah yeah it's just not it's sundry items and that's all it is oh well lego is sorted yeah i'm <laughs> a little bit unimpressed with this i'm gonna have to get my spares out major time so these are all the instructions which i'm hoping that i can put together but it's i'm, I'm starting to be really dubious it's like even that one i thought i could do i haven't got white doors um i do have red doors so i'm gonna potentially like use the red doors but yeah it's like that one there's a lot of the interesting parts for this and i do have a lot of this put aside in my spares box which is all bagged up but it hasn't got any of the pipes and i know that that's one of the ones that i'm missing so i'm gonna end up having to buy them as spares which is a pain in the ass there's absolutely none no, nothing from this set maybe a few stickered parts and a few minifigures but frustratingly i have just sold that and i'm just gutted because i could have sold it with the instructions that there's literally none of that that's a tea card um yeah there's there's none of there's none of that one on there i don't even know why that's in there so yeah slightly disappointed I can't put that one together but I have got that one I haven't sold that one yet so I might just put it with it um but it might not even be worth declaring it because it's like in three pieces <laughs> um yeah I'm going to see what I've got anyway and put, put these together stop being so negative that's what uh, that's what Ziggy says why be so negative man it's Lego all Lego is good it's I think the thing for me is there's a lot of stuff which is very obviously other sets and they're not there like that i've looked that one up and this is from a very specific space set but there's nothing else from it <laughs> so it is all a bit peculiar that hasn't got me very far and yeah I, I, it, it is just a bit disappointing from what i've paid for it but never mind i will just put these together and um get what i can listed on ebay and of course it will help me with whatever i've got in spares so let's not be negative hey okay, i've reached a bit of a stopping point this is what i've done so far uh, i've done the garage here only substitution is the doors that's a 20 pound set this one here this is only like a 10 pound set and i have actually got another one of them and it hasn't sold but obviously these have all got instructions with them which is a bonus this one i can't it's probably a 30 to 40 pound set so this oh the geezer's head's fallen off i've got a much better minifigure because the torsos they've got a better graphic on it but his head keeps coming off it's only when he's got his uh, his head stays on when he's got his air tanks on come on now yes yeah, so his head stays on oh no it doesn't does it what an idiot i don't know what's wrong with that anyway this little buggy thing fits inside it sort of like slides inside there um i should be able to get i should be able to get at least 30 for that i don't know if it's one of these more expensive set because i know that some of them are a bit odd in the um prices that you get because i've had one very similar to that recently they sold for 50 like within an hour of me listing it and i was like uh, i feel like i've underpriced that uh this just sold this i sold this for 20 it was very faded the one that i've just sold and obviously i didn't have instructions so i may well try for 25 for this because i've got the instructions i've been able to do the helicopter i had all of the uh, colored parts for that so i was able to do the helicopter that doesn't fetch much it's probably going to be 15 
to 20 for that. This has got a colour sub on the loudspeaker bit. I've put a black one at the back. Obviously, I've got the box. It's a bit annoying, really. <laughs> it is very annoying. Uh, but what can you do? I think that one's only like a 15 pound set. This is like a five to ten pound set, more like five because it's just so basic. But again, got the instructions, but I don't think that makes hide nor hair. These are quite rare figures, so I've got a whole bunch of these. I thought they appeared in a castle set as well, but apparently they don't. They just appear in a set like this. This is another one where it's quite a shame that I didn't have this before because one of the things that I was short on when I was doing the castle, the yellow castle, I didn't have the correct swords. So the vintage swords are usually this colour grey. Let me show you. So the vintage swords are usually that colour grey, but this is like a much lighter shade of grey. So... I don't know how much this, I haven't actually looked this up. I haven't got all the weapons for this either. And I've only got one shield. But I think they're quite desirable because they're old minifigures. Um, and then I've put this one together, which is just a tow truck. I've got the stickers, but it's very worn on that side and very, very worn on that side. I would imagine that one's only a five pounder. And then I'm just in the process of pulling the parts for this. But I'm also in the process of putting all this Lego away because I don't want it sat on the living room floor. I've got a lot more sets which I can do inventories for, but I need to draw a line under it because otherwise I end up with Lego out on the floor for days on end. Obviously, I've got the base plate that I can do that. I've got this set over here. Um, that's the. This is the website that I use to do the inventory. Which I just find this one a lot more easier. So this this pile that's over here I didn't have the base plates obviously I had the base plates myself that's for this set which I need to put together but I may well be putting that together another day I mean I can't do any photos today I know it like looks fantastic here but it is actually getting dark it's just because this is a low light camera <laughs> that this looks okay and I'm actually quite surprised. in my process of looking through my spares I found this which is part of a hay bale set which I can actually get £40 for so I'm really pleased to have found that. I've got bunches of mini figures here so I've got loads and loads of stuff which I can put together but I'm just gonna put it all aside for the time being and then work on it. I'm gonna put everything away and then work on it in a more manageable way so it's like I've got the I've got the drawers out here, so I've got the drawers to put the wheels away. I've just put some of the car pieces away. <clears throat> I just want to get control of it so that I've got everything in my drawers and then I can go through the spares. So I'm going to put, put aside all the pieces there which I've got and work through the rest of it because it, I've got bits left over from previous job lots and I, I've got another job lot coming, <laughs> which I bought this morning. Although the feedback suggests that he probably won't send it his son it wasn't positive feedback <laughs> so anyway that's what i've done that's a deep i mean i definitely get my money back by selling all of that and make a little bit of profit and then obviously i've got profit in um the rest of the sets when i put them together so i hope that that was of interest um ziggy oh ziggy are you tired man are you tired, man? Yeah, I'm tired, but I always find energy for Lego. So, I'm going to carry on doing my Lego thing tonight. And I will see you again in another Vlogtober video. Thanks for watching. You best subscribe. Or I might turn up in the night and imagine that. Imagine opening your eyes to see me wielding a piece of Lego. <gasps> subscribe. Or get Lego in the eye.